Developments today in ABC 15's investigation of a group of serial sewers who've been taking aim at Valley businesses. The Attorney General's office now stepping in and it could shut them down. ABC 15 investigator Dave Biscabing has been digging into the Advocates for Individuals with Disabilities Foundation, AID for short. He's been doing it for months. He's on assignment today and joins us by phone. And Dave, what does today's development really mean? Well, ADA sued more than 1,500 businesses for alleged ADA violations and to settle, demands thousands to settle. And now the AG's office is essentially saying, hey, wait a minute, ADA compliance is not your job, that's our job. Now, the AG's office just intervened in a case this afternoon. Basically, that means they inserted themselves into the lawsuit and are challenging AID's authority to mass file these cases. In a motion, AG officials said AID is trolling for lawsuits and shouldn't be allowed to get fees. They even said it appears they are doing this for their own enrichment. And right now, in a typical case, aid is often demanding $7,500 to start from businesses. So AG officials told me they stepped in specifically because of our investigation and the things we uncovered about aid. Now, our reports are cited throughout their motion, and the AG's office is declining to comment, saying the motion speaks for itself. So it's not clear if they will expand to other cases. But one more thing I want to point out is that this is a civil action, and the state has a civil investigation open right now. But AG officials haven't ruled out the possibility of a criminal investigation.